I currently like our application. It is much better. We don't see the dashboard link and therefore we cannot be able to visit our dashboard. But what happens if someone tries to navigate to the dashboard manually? There's only one way to find out. Let's try it out. So I'll come here and go to slash dashboard. Oh my God. What is happening? We are making two steps forward, one step back. But let's fix it. We are developers and our work is to solve problems, right? Let's go to our routes. And here we want all our routes to be visible to the entire world, regardless of whether you are logged in or not. Except for these three routes. This is where we draw the line. So we only want the login route to be um, visible if someone is a guest. So what you can do, we can use the, meet, the meta property and we say it requires guest to be true. The same for the register. And then for the dashboard, we only want it to be visible if someone is logged in. So we will set requires auth to be true. So it doesn't require you to be a guest. Then after that, I have this code that I had already pasted here and I'm going to explain what is happening. So we are going to use a method from this router called before each. And this, let me remove all this. So it's a, it's a method. Then inside it, we are calling another function. And this function takes two argument. The first one is true to the route that we are visiting. And this one will check which route we are coming from. Then in here, I'm checking the local storage. So remember, if we are logged in, the local storage will have something. If you are not, it will be empty. So here we are checking if we are authenticated, if it's true. So it's not checking, sorry. We are, yeah, yeah, we are checking for, from the local storage. If we, the authenticated is true. Then we are going to run this if statement. So we are checking, is authenticated true? That passes. Then we are checking, is the route that the person is visiting requires guest to be true. So let's for, say, for example, someone is visiting the login route. It checks. It, does it have the meta of requires guest to be true? If that is correct, we return, to, we redirect that person to the dashboard. Then we are also checking, is authenticated false? Like in our case now in the browser, authenticated is false. Then it goes ahead and check. Does the route that we are, miss, we are visiting have this meta requires auth to be true? Yes, it has. Requires auth to be true. So we are, we are not authenticated and meta requires auth is true. So if all this is true, we redirect them to the login route. Let's see if that's working. I'll save that. Come back here. And then we automatically redirect it to the login. If I try to... Go to the dashboard again. Dashboard. We are redirected to the login. Let's try to log in and try the other routes when we are logged in. So here, login. I'm logged in. Let's try to visit the login route. get redirected to the dashboard. Let's try register. So register back to the dashboard again. That's it for this lesson. In the next lesson, let's see how to clear session. Let's see how to clear the local storage rather when someone session expires. See you then. Cheers.